Welcome to the new episode of How to Electronics. In this episode, we will learn how to make IoT based air quality monitoring system using air quality sensor. We will use an IoT platform called ThingSpeak server where we will display the data of air quality. Then we will go through the Arduino programming where we will be learning about the library and the method of uploading the code to the ThingSpeak server. We will use 0.96 inch I2C OLED display where the instant air quality in PPM will be displayed. As a detector, air quality sensor is used. For sensing agent, we will be using the smoke. So we will be simply uploading the data of air quality that is in PPM in ThingSpeak server. But before that, I would like to inform you the official sponsor of this video is NextPCB. NextPCB is one of the biggest PCB manufacturer company in China. Currently, they are having the two different offer. The first offer is the 10% discount on all the assembly service. So for that, just collect the point and then go to the account. Here you can see there is a 10% discount code. Using this discount, you can order any amount of PCB with 10% discount. Now the second offer is the infrared thermometer that cost around $50 for the fight back of COVID-19. So here is the description of the next PCB. They are the biggest PCB manufacturer company in China. They make all the different type of PCB boards with all the assembly services. So you can order the PCB service from the next PCB website here. Let us begin with the circuit diagram first. So 0.96 inch I2C OLED display has 4 pins. So connects its SD and SCK pin to D2 and D1 of node MCU. Supply it with 3.3 volt PCC. We have MQ135 air quality sensor. Connects its output analog pin to A0 of node MCU. Supply it with 5 volt through B in pin. So here is a real connection. How we have assembled the circuit to the breadboard. We have node MCU board, 0.96 inch OLED display and MQ135. Now go to the thingspeak.com and create an account here so after creating an account just create a channel i already created a channel so this is how you have to define i have given the name and i have defined the field one as eqi i have just saved the channel now when you go to the private view you can see nothing is displayed as no data is sent over here let us begin with the code first esp 8266 wi is for node mcu library SPIN wire is for I2C, MQ135, Adafruit GVFX and Adafruit SST1306. You can get all this library from the link in the description below. Similarly, we have assigned the OLED display width, height and a reset pin. From here, you can change the Wi-Fi SSID, password and API key as we are using API server as api.thingspeak.com. Okay. From here, we will have initialize the i2c oled uh, serial begin function and uh, wi-fi begin so that all of the function will start working so since the wi-fi is connected the oled display will display the status as the wi-fi is connected or not under the loop function we are just calculating the value of air quality index from the mq 135.h library so this data is displayed on serial monitor similarly the same data is displayed on OLED display and then using this post function we are sending the air quality index data over field 1 through to thing speak. You can change the value of delay from here that is you can mean use the minimum delay of 15 seconds as data to the thing speak is uploaded only after the interval of 15 seconds. So simply upload the code and open the serial monitor set the baud rate to 115200. So here the node MC will start connecting to the Wi-Fi. So once connected to the Wi-Fi, it will display the air quality index and it will start sending it over the ThingSpeak server. You can simply see here how the data is sent over the ThingSpeak server. Now you can open the ThingSpeak and here you can see how the data is entered. Similarly on the I2C OLED display, once it is connected to the computer, it will start connecting to the Wi-Fi. Once connected, it will display Wi-Fi connected and then it will simply start displaying the air quality index in ppm ppm means part per million the measure of air quality is in ppm value always okay so what i will do is 
I would like to take a incense stick and then I will simply introduce the smoke over the surface of net lag structure on MQ-135 so you can see the air quality index value is rising. So simply go to the Thingspeak web server and you can see data will be uploaded to the Thingspeak website after the interval of 15 seconds. So the video I have showing you is 300 times faster that's why it is saying the fast speed. So here you can see the OLED display is displaying the some value of smoke. Similarly the Thingspeak server is also displaying the similar value. So you can use this project as a IoT project or simply you can also use this project as a non IoT project that is you can simply show it see it on a OLED display. You can extend this product by adding PM 2.5 particular matter sensor as well. So this is all about the today's video. Hope you like this video and hope you like this project. If you have any doubt and query, you can simply comment down below in the comment section.